What is going on, dude? Let's go back to the vault. It's your boy, MC Tennis Titties, and MC Fucking Tired Titties too. Um, the film I'll be reviewing this evening is King Richard. <clears throat> Let's just jump straight into it. Um, this one opens with an introduction to Richard Williams uh, before we meet the two uh, tennis superstars um, as young children. Uh, such a talented cast for this one. Will Smith plays the title character and honestly gives such a varied and emotional performance. Um, you can tell he wanted to understand the man he was playing so he could play him faithfully and respectfully. Um, Smith is joined by the likes of, and I'm definitely going to butcher this first name, Anjanu. Ornjanu Ellis, my apologies, Tony Goldwyn, Lee Schreiber, Dylan McDermott and John Bernthal. Um, the standouts though uh, were young Demi Singleton and Sunia Sidney. These two talented actresses played the young Venus and Serena and honestly both did fantastic jobs. Um, they really held their own. I was very impressed with their performances. Um, the story for this one tells of the father and driving force behind two of the best tennis superstars in the world. Um, obviously, I know of the Williams sisters, even though I don't follow tennis. Um, but I had no idea their father had such an influence on their li on on their lives and in their careers. Um, the narrative was just as much about Richard Williams as it as it was um, about the two athletes. Um, it's it's sweet that they both wanted to pay homage to the man. I'm guessing because both of them co-produced this film, that the image we got of the man was pretty pretty faithful. Um, there was also a really faithful look into the d dynamic of their family um, when they were young. Um, there was so much love and, and support in their family, and I really loved that. I loved that even though Serena was somewhat left behind whilst her sister's uh, star rose before hers, she still gave uh, Venus so much love and support and was happy for her successes. Um, this, that was just really lovely to see. Um, there were also some great emotional scenes, especially between Williams uh, and his wife and, and he and Venus and uh, just the two daughters in general. Um like I said before, I like that the film painted Rich Williams in a truthful and faithful light. I'm the, I'm in the film. He does come across as overbearing and somewhat controlling, but that's all because he wants what's best for his daughters and wants to protect them. Um, he wasn't a perfect man. Uh, nobody, nobody is, but I loved that the two sisters wanted to show him to the world, flaws and all. Um, I'm not sure if it actually happened or it was just dramatic license, but Richard does let go and allow Venus to make strong uh, and confident choices. Um, Renardo Marcus Green directs this one, and whereas he is a fairly new director, um, he gives an enjoyable film with some insight into two of the world's biggest sports stars. Um, he allows Serena and Venus the, the the chance to paint a picture of their father and upbringing, and, and then massively translates that to to the script and screen. Um, hope he has more pro more projects like this uh, in in the future. I was very impressed and and, and enjoyed um, this first work of his um, quite thoroughly. Um, and the only thing I really learned from this is that no one p quite pulls on my heartstrings like a sad Will Smith. It's just something about him in a, in a sad role like this, I guess. Um, but anyway, guys, there's my very quick review for King Richard. Um, let's jump to the two most important questions. Question number one is, would I recommend this film? I mean, if you're, if you're a huge tennis fan and you're a huge fan of, you know, Venus and Serena Williams, then 100% go, go and watch this film. Um, you know, but even if you're not... I'm a huge fan of them, and you know you're just a fan of films in general. You know and you you like to kind of catch every film you can. Um, then again, I I would go and watch this film. Um, it's like I said, even if you're not a tennis fan, you know it's it's there's something there uh, for everyone. There's a nice story. It's emotional. It's funny at times. Um, question number two: Does this film belong in the vault? I guess my only issues with this film was that it was a little long. That I would have liked to have seen more of Serena's struggle. It did focus on her somewhat, but it was mainly Venus we saw more of. Um, those are very, very small issues that I had with this film. Um, it felt like, um, as I've said before, I'm I'm not a huge fan of the of tennis in general, and, and the Williams sisters. Obviously, I've heard of them. Um, so any film like this that can make me, you know interested in something i'm not usually interested in um you know i think it's always a, a skill it's always a good thing um and i enjoyed this film more than i thought i would um i'm not wouldn't say i'm a huge fan of tennis now after seeing this film but i did enjoy this film um so obviously for those reasons there's a little diamond star it's gone off followed by a uh, from one of the williams sisters 
I don't know. There we have it, guys. This is my review for King Richard. As always, if you've seen the film and you loved it, let me know what you loved down in the comments below. If you hated it, for whatever reason, again, let me know what you hated. Be interested to know what you disliked. Um, and as always, guys, if you like what I'm doing here, please don't forget to like, subscribe, share this video with your friendly neighbourhood, friends, pets, families, and your friendly neighbourhood fucking tennis superstars. I don't know. I'm tired. Until the next one. Peace love me dudes.